Twitter's working is the pain and family peace, but all love in all in. Like, the link to the video will be the description below. Go and check my soul. Let's get into this working in three, two, one. Jumping jack, get warmed up. Hey, you guys, it's nothing short of a miracle that we are having the Easter egg hunt this year. <laughs> yeah. Lindsay predicted that the snow would melt. I said there's not a chance it would melt. And it's well, melted. It has melted. Just in the nick of from, time. We go from the worst snowstorm in degrees. 70 years. <laughs> well, not the worst storm, but the, the, some of the highest snow levels in 70 years. And I predict, and I was wrong. <laughs> and now we have 60 degree weather today. It's, it's actually pretty nice snow. this morning. It's already 50 degrees at 10 o'clock, no, 9 o'clock in the morning. Feels really good out here. We don't here. need coats. I think oh. we a foot of snow in two hours last Tuesday. So we had a ton, ton, ton of snow. Uh, snow, 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 snow! And no, just yesterday no, it melted. No. I mean, the ground might be wet. There's, I think, a, there's, there's some remnants of snow still out here. I think it might want to be one of our smallest Easter egg hunts because I think the snow scared people away this year. But I guess that means more candy yeah. and more eggs for the kids that are here. So, yeah. as you know, this is a tradition that Mindy and I have been doing since the kids were tiny, tiny. And even though they moved away just a few months ago, we are continuing the tradition. They're coming back for the Easter egg hunt. Jumping jacks to get warmed up. <laughs> There's a tax, just so you know, Lando. Yeah, there is tax. No, 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 no. I can't, I can't, girls. I can't. I can't. What is in there? Money. 100 grand. <laughs> oh, oh, hey, oh, hey, oh, hey, oh, hey, oh, hey, oh, hey, oh, here. No, 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 no. Um, here, Ava, take this right here. Uh, yeah. There you go. How did you figure it out? I was just looking at the hole and I was like, they're ready to Dang go it. Out. The back is from PG Dolby Pino. You can see the head of PG Dolby Pino. Okay, cool. Easter egg cool. hunt success. And look at the sun shining on us right now, you guys. Look at this. Next part of the day. We have a lot of fun plans this weekend. We are going on a bike ride with Mana Joe. <laughs> and check out that helmet. No, no, you love it. I love it. Unicorns, I love them. Unicorn, I love them. We didn't want to go home and get her bike, so we grabbed her bike in our garage and also a helmet, which is why she's wearing the unicorn helmet. And none of the kids will trade with her. You know, turn. thank you for letting me wear yours. Thank you, honey. We've got ourselves the Havasco Alpha. A hay bike over here, which is Lindsay's. This one we actually even talked about. This is the ad motor. This bike is sick. This is more for Lando here because he can ride tandem with Turin on it, or me, right? Another Havasco over here. I forget what that one's called, Ashy. The Ranger. The Ranger. Then Ava and I are cruising on the Varla electric scooter. This thing's pretty sick. Dual power. Like yeah, that's right. Oh. 
let's move. Okay, you guys, we are back from our bike ride with Mana Joe. It feels so good to be outside again with the sun shining and the weather warm. We haven't had weather like this. It's really hot though. <laughs> well, that's yeah. what's funny is it's not actually hot. What is the temperature right now? 67. Oh, that 67. is really warm. But because wow. we've had a long, long winter, 59 feels like we should be swimming. <laughs> it feels so good outside. Yeah, but we took Grandma on the loop that goes around our house and we lent her one of our bikes. I think bike riding is going to be one of our favorite things this spring and summer because we have a lot of really cool new bikes. Some that we need to share in more detail, right Justin? Yes, yes, we'll get that. So, tomorrow's Easter. So we're doing a lot of Easter prep. I've been trying to make sure that we have all the groceries for tomorrow. I think the Easter Bunny might be coming tomorrow. Have you heard anything? No. You haven't? I noticed something this year. What did you notice? The Easter bunny was not the Easter egg hunt. <laughs> he wasn't, you're right. He must be busy working on your Easter baskets. But we're doing something else really yeah. fun today. We haven't done this in a while. I decided we need to do it more often. We're going up to our store, Duck Donuts. If you're new here, Duck we are Donuts. part yep. owners in a franchise called Duck Donuts here in Utah. If you're ever in Utah, it's in South Jordan. And they are made to order cake donuts. They are so so good especially hot i always tell people that my favorite is when they're like freshly made and still warm donuts is there anything they can't do but you can choose whatever toppings you want whatever little drizzles and frostings you want on it and then they make it right in front of you so they have this really cool glass thing. yes and then like a stair that you can like so you can stand up and look at them while they make them. Yep. So they make them right there, fresh in the fryer, and then they top them there right in front of you. They also have other really cool things on the menu, though. They have milkshakes with where you can put like a donut on the straw. It's really cute. And then they also have donut, a breakfast donut. sandwich where instead of the bun for the top and bottom, they use donuts for the top and bottom. You can do bacon, egg, and cheese, or sausage, egg, and cheese. Kind of like McGriddle-ish, right? Where you've got like the sweet and savory. So the kids are gonna go up and order some of that stuff so you guys can see it and we're gonna get some donuts for tomorrow morning because we're gonna do our Easter brunch after church and have some duck donuts before church to make it a little easier in the morning. Okay, you guys, we are dying Easter eggs tonight. But I'm just gonna give you a little piece of reality over here, okay? <laughs> We've got one girl and three boys. And I will just tell you that I did something cool this year. I bought these little tattoos. I've got like all these under the water, sea, whatever. Comment down below if you like donuts. Comment down below. And then I've got butterflies. It's actually turning out really For me, uh, a lot of donuts. Really cool. I saw this idea. Look how pretty that is. But this part kind of came off. That's okay. So she did the tattoo and then she dyed it. I even think it's cool with just the tattoo on it. This is like a pretty little butterfly. Turin gets out early on Wednesdays. Earlier today, he was playing basketball, then he was playing spike ball, and he was supposed to go to a soccer game tonight and basically told me I ruined his life because- Wow, I did not say that. <laughs> Turin told me tonight, he's like, mom, do you realize 
how embarrassing it is. Tell my friends yeah. I can't go to the soccer game because I have to go home and die Easter eggs after <laughs> Easter. No, not, not Easter eggs <laughs> is one thing, but no, it's after Easter. <laughs> so he over there thinks that he's so funny. I'm telling him he has to die I'm Easter eggs. He's funny. Instead of dying Easter eggs, he is currently <laughs> patting himself up over here. Let's just see that. Let's see what's happening, Jordan. <laughs> we got two on his knees. I told him you can't do that. You have to dye your Easter eggs. So then, what does he do? He starts filling all. No, no, no. Technically, that Ava all started throwing a fit. So then Ava gets upset because he has all of his eggs in the bowls at once. I mean, have you ever seen such a work of art in your life? Are you giving them a tutorial yeah, on how to do tattoos? <laughs> About ten seconds. I just you have so many on you right now. I'm just a tattoo well, artist. Yeah, you gotta hold it longer. Okay, this is Ashton's first egg. Totally crushing it. He's got a I cool whale. Say first day. He's got a cool whale, and then he's got a pink egg. Okay, well, how do I put this one on now? Hey, wait, let's show him this one. Lando's doing some cool colors over here. Mm -hmm. You wanna try a tattoo, Lando? I've never done it, so yeah. We're also sipping on some watermelon juice. When you have watermelon that's left over, and it's kind of mushy, so you watermelon don't really want to eat it anymore. Oh no, emergency, <laughs> finished product. We got a cracked one. Now I'm gonna This was the emergency. Toast. You just, I'm sorry. Oh, I got a butterfly in my belly button. <laughs> you guys, the tattoo situation is getting out of control. And everyone thinks it's so funny. This is not what we had planned for tonight. <laughs> Wow, that was really, wow. That was the Pinion Family Piece by Olaf in Orleans. A link to the video will be the description below. Go and check my intro by like, if you like. And comment down below if you want to see more reaction like this one. And subscribe if you want to. And click the post to be notified for a video below. And watch. Bye.